Rob and Judy, despite the city's violence prevention efforts, it was a violent Memorial Day weekend here in Chicago. I caught up with Mayor Brandon Johnson at an unrelated event today. He says we have a tremendous amount of work to do, but was encouraged to see people coming together over the weekend in hopes of building a safer Chicago. We definitely have to come together as a community to continue to work on this. Uh, we are in a state of emergency. This Memorial Day weekend left 10 people dead, 44 others wounded in shootings across the city. Overnight, a triple shooting in the 9100 block of South Harper. A 59-year-old man, 57-year-old woman, and a 77-year-old man were all shot while standing on the sidewalk. We have a lot of work to do in the city. Poverty didn't go away over the weekend. Like we understand that when communities have been disinvested in and traumatized, that you're seeing the manifestation of that trauma. Early Saturday morning, another deadly shooting in Lakeview. 35-year-old William Hare was shot and killed while walking with a friend near Broadway in Surf. He is one of five people shot over the past four days in that area. And last night, a 24-year-old man is now charged with child endangerment after police say a two-year-old boy was shot while playing in a bedroom with an adult when a gun went off near 79th and Hermitage. The second young child shot that day after a two-year-old girl also found a gun and accidentally shot herself. This is not an accident. This is negligence due to these guns inside these homes with no lock on it. Get a lock, lock it down, save these children. The violence comes despite Mayor Brandon Johnson's new safety plan to increase police on the streets and involve more community groups to help curb crime. Over the weekend, he was in Englewood at an event bringing families together to prevent gun violence. So this weekend, what you saw on display is that everybody recognizes is that it's going to take all of us to unite this city and to build a better, stronger, safer city. In an open roll call on the southwest side, the 8th District Chicago Police Commander vowed to work diligently to protect residents. Our guys are running in a gunfire. They're running into danger. It's difficult. It's definitely trying time. And Mayor Johnson says he will continue working with all of the city's partners to better address the root causes of crime and bring necessary support to communities.